Welcome back to Open Med School. In the last sessions we have discussed about the generation of resounds, what is normal resound or normal vesicular resound, and what is bronchial resound. Today we'll be discussing various types of resounds, the way bronchial resounds. So the basic quality of the bronchial resound is that it is a high pitch sound. The, there is no pause. There is pause between inspiration and expiration, and expiratory phase is long so this is how you it is equal or more than the inspiration sometimes so let us look into the types of bronchial breathing bronchial breath sounds are divided into one the high pitch sound otherwise called the tubular breath sound tubular or high pitch sounds Second is low pitch bronchial breath sound, otherwise called the cavernous breath sound. Cavernous. And third is there is a type of breath sound called amphoric breath sound. So these are the types of breath sounds that we should be familiar with. The high pitch bronchial breathing are breath sounds are heard when the normal lung parenchyma is destroyed and the airway is patent. So what will happen? The lung will, the filtering action of the lung is lost. For example, suppose this part gets consolidated. Consolidation means the lung, the alveolus gets solidified and solids are good conductors of sound. So what will happen? If the airway is patent, the breath sound will appear as bronchial. So the tubular breath sounds are heard in classically in consolidation. And cavernous breath sounds are heard when there is a cavitation in the lung, the superficial cavity and the longus is patent. So it is a cavernous, you remember by cavity. Amphoric breath sound is characteristic of a large cavity that is communicating with the bronchus and you will get a sound similar to as if you are blowing across the a bottle. This sort of sound is characteristic of amphoric breath sound. So what is amphoric breath sound? Amphoric breath sounds are low pitch sounds. They are low pitch bronchial breathing with high pitched overtones. High pitched overtones. That is a term you should remember. The, we will discuss about overtones and harmonics in another session. So basically there is a tubular breath sound which is high pitched heard over consolidation or lung is damaged but the Bronchus is patent as in a case of collapse of lung or large pleural effusion where the lung is collapsed but the bronchus is patent. Carbonus is heard over cavity and amphoric can occur in a large cavity communicating or sometimes a pneumothorax which is communicating that is otherwise called the pre bronchopleural fistula. You may get a sound. So this is in summary regarding the vesicular breath sound. This is the vesicular breath sound. You can see the inspiration is longer. The expiration only the initial part is heard. This is the bronchovesicular breath sound where there is no pause between inspiration and expiration, but the expiration is prolonged. And here we can see. It is a tubular breath sound where there is a definite pause between inspiration and expiration and it is little high pitched. So amphoric breath sound as already I have mentioned as if you are blowing across the jar. The term amphorus means jar. When there is a superficial cavity which is communicating of around 5 to 6 centimeters. 
again we can get a arm pulling the sound the cavity should be smooth old and the breath sound resonates inside the and that is the reason for development of amphoric breath sound as mentioned the amphoric breath sound has is a low pitch breath sound with the high pitch vowel tones and has got a metallic character so the character it has got a metallic character as mentioned you can get in open pneumothorax large cavity or bronco pleural fistula and regarding the tubular breath sound already i have mentioned when the lung is consolidated and the bronchus is patent the consolidated lung is a good medium for conductor conduction of sounds you get a bronchial breathing over there sometimes fibrosis of the lung collapse of the lung there is a large pleural effusion where the underlying lung may be collapsed but the bronchus is patent again you can get bronchial breathing sometimes even in a mediastinal tumor which is in opposition with a large bronchus you can get a bronchial breathing so in this session we have discussed about the various types of bronchial breathing the high pitch tone tubular which is heard over consolidation cavernous over cavity and the amphoric over large cavity which is communicating or an open pneumothorax or bronchopleural fistula hope this session was useful to you stay tuned for further videos